going to be updating my icing highlights um, with how to make royal icing in the Bosch mixer. So many of you know that I received this mixer. I bought it on Black Friday and I have been totally loving it. I've been using it for my dough and it's completely cut down on my dough prep time. So I am going to do royal icing in it today as well and I'll take you guys along. So in here I already have three quarters of warm water, one to two tablespoons of white corn syrup and a teaspoon of pure vanilla extract. So I'm going to put this into the bowl with um, two thirds a cup of meringue powder oh, and I'm going to with my little mini whisk here until it's foamy texture. already starting to kind of foam or froth so just scraping the sides of the bowl to make sure that there's no dried clumps of meringue powder just give it a quick whirl with the paddle attachment in goes two pounds of powdered sugar. This mixer can easily hold a double batch of icing. So if you were needing a lot, you could easily batch of this. And then one of my favorite things about this mixer is it has a lid. So I'm gonna grab that. And then we're gonna turn it on for two to three minutes. Once my icing was complete, I always put it into these airtight cambros and it's ready for me to scoop out and color as needed. So when I purchased my, um, I had a promotion code to get the free baker's pack with it and it included this bowl scraper, which is um, the whisks attachment and it has these little um, blades to scrape the cookie paddles and the cake paddles which is what what I use today to make the royal icing. It comes with the dough hook which is what I normally use to make my sugar cookie dough. So um, I've just been completely loving it. I would give you guys a little how-to on how to make royal icing. Mm -hmm. 